So Phasmophobia releases right in time for spooky season. The month of October, Halloween, it's all good things. The game is so interesting, but it's bad. So for those of you that don't know, Phasmophobia is a game that involves you and your friends hunting ghosts and you use your like own voice to trigger like the ghost to do certain things. For example, like give us a sign and he'll turn the lights on or off or he'll throw something off a shelf or something like or along those lines. The game itself is so fascinating to me just because of the idea behind it where you can use your own your own voice to um like interact with the ghost i think that's the coolest fucking thing in the world but the game lacks the actual horror aspect of it and everyone i've talked to so far is like no the game's good it's cool it's cool they must not have played other horror games then because i want to be scared shitless when i play a horror game a great horror game that I like to reference when I talk about horror games is Case Animatronics. One of the absolutely most horrifying games that I have ever played. Will never play it again. Let me show you why. Anyways, to bring us back, the game of Phasmophobia lacks jump scares. That's one of the main things it lacks. When you die, you there's there's no like oh shit aspect. There's no there's no scare. It's just like two hands wrap around your face and then a fucking light bulb bursts and then you're a ghost. There are games that are less like appealing and fascinating but give better jump scares if this game had a good base of jump scares or like some sort of like acceleration to it it would be so good so many streamers so many creators have been playing this game and it is it's something it's like a, it's like the hype behind among us like people are getting onto it and they're like yeah this game's cool like it's sick i think so too but i cannot run around a big ass high school for 20 minutes trying to find which one of the fucking 40 rooms in the school itself that the spirit's in. And then when I do find it, trying to figure out, like, what equipment I'm going to need, how I'm going to track this motherfucker down, how I'm going to figure out what I need to figure out to get the hell out of there. There's just too much, like, statistical aspect to it and not enough, like, suspense and... um like black like pop to it it, it, ah, it just grinds my gears phasmophobia if you guys want to fix this redesign the way you die in the game i think the idea of like locking the doors and turning around and seeing a ghost is perfect but add more acceleration to that like the the ghost jumping up behind you and fucking turning you around and scaring the shit out of you or something that oh it could be such a good game and that's why it makes me so mad but i don't know i just needed to rant um if you guys enjoyed the video uh you know what to do you know leave a like comment subscribe turn the bell on for notifications <sighs> Let me know what you guys think because I am I I just got done streaming this game and we ran around for 35 40 minutes trying to find what room this motherfucker was in and we were on the hardest difficulty. So it it should have been like more accelerated, more fast paced, no grace period in the beginning where we have to find the room. It took us 35 minutes to find the room and it came to a point where I was like, "Okay, just kill me so I can speed this shit up." Eliminate that bring jump scares in and you have a great game a great game please 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 add more to the game because it's a it's a sick game i love the game but i hate the fact that there isn't enough 
horror to the game. I am just ranting at this point. Hopefully you guys have a great rest of your day. Um, yeah, later.